This video will show you how to don your MSA SCBA in the right way. Please follow all steps very strictly. Make sure that shoulder straps are fully extended. Don the SCBA like a backpack. Close hip belt and tighten loose ends towards the front. Tighten shoulder straps until back plate fits comfortably. Most of the weight should still be on the hip. Take the demand valve and push the red button to switch it off. Insert nipple of demand valve into the coupling of the medium pressure line until it snaps. Check the cylinder pressure by opening the cylinder valve and reading the gauge. For 300 bar cylinders, it should be no less than 270 bar. For 200 bar cylinders, no less than 180 bar. The high pressure tightness test is performed by closing the cylinder valve and checking the pressure gauge. The pressure must not drop more than 10 bar in 60 seconds. To perform the test of the warning whistle, partially close the exit port with your palm. Press the green cover of demand valve to activate the flushing mode. The warning signal must sound at around 55 bar. Push the red button to switch off the demand valve. Take the mask and spread the head harness with both hands. Then. Place your chin into the chin stop and pull the harness over your head. Tighten straps, starting with neck straps, then temple straps, and finally forehead strap. To perform a leak test, completely cover the connector opening with your palm. Inhale and hold the breath. No air shall leak in. Open cylinder valve fully by turning hand wheel counterclockwise for about two turns until it stops. Do not force hand wheel into end position. Insert demand valve into the adapter of the mask until it distinctly snaps. Inhale sharply to activate demand valve. The SCBA is now ready for use. Breathe normally and quietly and perform your tasks.